But one of the things we have to do is we have to expose those communities to people of success that come from those communities. Mm. Now, and I ain't saying always if it's your community, somebody can just do somebody. Right, right. You know, right, and, right. and say, man, look, I come from that. Yeah. You know, and so I think where I have a good, you know, and, and it's going to probably be exposed a little bit more this year, but with me, what I do is I use my past to try to motivate them. Right. You know, because they'll see me in a suit and tie and they'll think we're so detached. Yes. But I tell them this is a game. Yes. But when they find out, you know, when I tell them I've been shot, mm -hmm. I've been incarcerated, I've been those things, now I got a relationship with them. Right. So now they see me as real, mm -hmm. but they all see me, also see me as successful. Right. So people like that, more successful men have to go back. And that's how you really change it. When they start seeing themselves as you, because the, 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 the gap is too big. So you, you won't change it within the community. you got to change it from outside. So the outside have to come inside. But we do such a poor job, especially as black men, when we make it, we don't want to come back to that.